All right, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to part three of episode five. So we are closing on the end of Batman. Enjoy. All right, so let's get this show on the road. Let's see what we're up against now. Nervous. Isn't everyone before their first crime scene? How do you... I mean, how do we do this? Watch what I do, and keep cool. Easier said than done. You'll get the hang of it. How do I sound? Oh, God! That's not how it's supposed to sound! That needs some work. You'll get it. Batman, I didn't expect to see you here. And this is? She's with me, Detective. We might not be able to give you a lot of time. With Waller kidnapped and me getting canned, no one's sure whose jurisdiction this crime scene falls under. The agencies or the GCPDs. So for now, let's go ahead and say it's yours, all right? My people are here to help however they can. Glad you're here, Jim. I'd heard that. Technically, I'm not here. Not in an official capacity, anyway. Working outside of the law. Let me know if you need any pointers. What should we be looking for? After the pack separated, Joker had to find somewhere else to hide. There could be clues here that tell us where that is, and where he may have taken Waller. So this partnership between you and Batman, when did that happen? It's new. Joker guy going nuts. I heard it started with Riddler's murder, but he's blaming Waller for it. Wouldn't actually surprise me. Riddler's murder? Really? But maybe it was always just a matter of time before he snapped. Festive, but not a lead. Joker's mark. W.D. Willie Deaver, Joker's associate. What do you have on him? Machinist by trade, with a storied employment history. He's been fired from almost every factory and chemical plant in Gotham. What? Has a drinking problem, apparently. Yeah. We're gonna need to narrow this down a bit. Hey, can I see your notes? Uh, sure thing, kid. Is this... You write your notes on paper. Yeah, well, I put them in the computer when I get to the office. I mean, you could put them down in a phone. Kid, look. I'll keep looking. Welcome, Agency Pigs. <laughs> there I thought that was our nickname. Guess not. I miss this, you know. You and me raking over a crime scene? Oh, I messed it up, didn't I? Now, in the early days when we were chasing you, not realizing you were one of the good guys, you and I came to an agreement. We worked together to make Gotham safer. I lost my head the other day. I want you to know I'm sorry. I cracked, like I said I would when Waller first moved in. 
You were just doing what you thought was right, Jim. There's nothing to apologize for. You're a good man for saying that. Thanks. I guess. Live missed this too. Got something interesting. It's a faint signal. Drone. Bane's venom. His suit was punctured. It's everywhere. Is it useful? No. Not in finding Joker. I'll add it to ignore on the drone search filters. Joker's knife. Must have lost it after he went into a frenzy against Bane. John Doe thought he could take on Bane? He's not half bad in a fight, actually. Bane's blood won't lead us to Joker. Nothing of note. Controller to the shock collars that Waller's using on the pact. Damaged. Can you isolate the signal from this device? Sure, but why? I've seen what these collars can do. Might come in handy. Forensics ran it through the system. Found it was stolen from the stacked deck a few weeks ago. I recognize it. It's been customized since then. My drone can analyze it. Just point and I'll shoot. Get some details on this paint. Funny. Doesn't look like a rush job. Because it's not. The drone sees a body shop quality strip below the top layer. The paint uses a stripping solvent that hasn't met compliance standards since. Cross-referencing this with Willie Deaver's employment history. There's only one match. Ace Chemicals. Their main plant was shut down last year after the city cited them for multiple safety violations. Because of the paint. The plant's been abandoned ever since. Perfect hiding spot. Yep. We found him. Well, well, well. What's all this then? A bat and a walking mustache trespassing on my crime scene. You escaped. <laughs> you got it all wrong, batty boy. I'm here on agency business. <sighs> For the love of God. That's right. I'm one of the good guys now. So hand over everything you found before I knock out those pearly ones. In the name of the law. Batman, we don't have time to mess around with this clown. Make time, copper. You all take orders from me now. You're going back to jail, Harley. I don't care what deal you made with Waller. Let me show you how things work around here now, Batsy. This is Agent Quinn, suppressing fire. These suits are convinced I can save their director from Big Bad Joker. They'll do anything for me. So all you gotta do is tell me where John took her, so I can get back to my job. After all, Johnny Boy and I are due for a nice, long talk. Poor guy's falling in with the wrong crowd. You know him better than anyone. Let's work together on this. Oh, now there's an idea. You can tee him up, and I'll knock his head off his shoulders with my government-issued hammer. We're taking him alive. That's so. Moff just got way less interesting. <laughs> and here I thought being diplomatic would work with you people. Oh well, I'll try something you can understand. I need to... Hey, you cops can't.
can't just shoot people like that. I'm off duty. Hello? What's the gal gotta do to get some... The hell? I can hack those collars in my sleep. Sending you off to Blackgate, where you belong. <laughs> oh, please! The agency isn't gonna let me sit in a cell. I'm an asset. I'm gonna get what I want, and there's not a damn thing you can do about it. You can't touch me, Bats. I'm the one in control here. You think you're in control? You'll live the rest of your life under the agency's thumb. No, that ain't how this works. I'm doing this thing on my terms. No one else is. Now tell that to Waller when she gets back in the office. Yeah. Idiot. Go find Joker before he carves up Waller. I'll clean up this mess. Have your people hold back until I call them. Waller's life may depend on a stealthy approach. <laughs> Batman. Good hunting. Well, this just got a lot more interesting here. Visual on Joker and Waller. Doesn't look like he's hurt her. Not yet. I'm in the rafters, out of sight. Say the word if you need help. Thanks. Bruce, I know you and Waller have your differences, but she doesn't deserve this. I take complete responsibility. Louder. So the camera can pick it up. Took you long enough. Batman! Thank God! I mean, I assumed you'd be okay. You're Batman, for Pete's sake. But still, are you okay, buddy? I was really worried about you. You nearly killed me when you blew up that roof. Sorry about that. I just got a little carried away. I had to do something. Waller was about to walk away, but get this, I'm this close to getting Waller to admit to every terrible thing she's ever done. And when that's over, I'll deliver her punishment. It'll, of course, have to reflect the enormity of her crimes. The only enormity I'm seeing is your jail <laughs> sentence. You're the one who needs to be put away, Joker. What? I'm just... Well-intentioned guy who sometimes makes 
teensy mistakes. Teensy? She's practically a, a war criminal. You know, I, I don't know why you're not more into this. Think of everything she's put you through. Yeah, Everyone is disposable to her. Even her own agents. I know I've made mistakes. You try to do the right thing, but there's always a cost. Just ask your pal Batman there. He'll say the same thing. I do what I do for a reason. I'm not ashamed. Don't play innocent. I play to win. When I lose, good people die. You're totally right. She sucks! Let's keep the show rolling. We've heard your excuses. You didn't mean for people to get hurt. Collateral damage, yada yada yada. But there's one crime that can't be excused. You killed the Riddler! And then you tried to pin it on me! Didn't kill him. Like I said. It was you! You killed Riddler! Say it! I will not. If there's one thing I learned by watching you, violence solves a lot of problems! Damn it, Batman! Stay out of my way! You need a distraction. While well, I get my confession. The way Boss talked about you, I thought you'd be bigger. This isn't about justice. You have a grudge against her. That's the only reason you're doing any of this. A grudge? Batman? She tried to kill me. I told you why I'm doing this. But you aren't listening. You're never listening. Just saying what you think will control me. Just like Lawler. She justifies her crimes. Says they're for the greater good. Just like you. You both use that word, justice, as an excuse. So you can do whatever you want. I thought you and I were two threads in the same stitch. But it's not me. It's her. I am justice. What I do keeps Gotham from becoming the swamp it once was. I've given everything to protect this city. Delusions of grandeur much? Yet another thing you have in common with Waller. Trying to do things your way was a mistake. Waller killed Riddler. And she deserved death! It wasn't Waller! Tiffany? I can't let someone else pay for my crimes. Waller didn't kill Riddler. I did. I what? know it was wrong. Now. Oh God, are you kidding me? These are the people you want to protect. I should kill them both. Everyone here is guilty. <laughs> this, is a, this is a joke. Leave them out of this, Joker. This is about you and me. Tell that to your distraction over there. I used a drone and these. There's your proof. You want to sacrifice yourself for Waller? Then go ahead! Just hold on. Murder is wrong. Trust the system. Violence isn't the answer. People just pick and choose what they believe. And you're no different. I got her! He's down! Hands where we can see them! 
after it. Everything we've been through together. This is how it is. Yes. This is the path you chose, Joker. It's always someone else's fault, isn't it? I believed in you, Batman. Well, not much. Like I never believed in anything. And it was all a lie!
should hate you for that. <laughs> but I, I don't. Because I, 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 I had such a good time with you, Bruce. Oh, shut the hell up. Did you ever, did you ever think of me as your friend? Of course. Of course you were my friend. <laughs> Without any more. <laughs> you are one messed up guy. That guy was something else. Unbelievable. <laughs> you too. I think the circumstances allow. Gordon was telling me how you found me. Sounds like top drawer detective work. It was a team effort. Batman led the charge. It's not easy to say this, but it looks like you saved my life. I guess that puts me in your debt. It's what I do. I save people. It's a shame we couldn't have saved more. I've got a lot of unpleasant phone calls to make. Jim, would you mind giving us a minute? Batman and I have some unfinished business. I'll go check on Joker's transfer, make sure they don't take any chances. Just try not to rip each other's heads off, okay? <laughs> we can all play nice now that the bad guy's in cuffs. Oh, no shit. You don't have to worry. Our stalemate from the roof still stands. I'm pulling out of Gotham effective immediately. Then why are we still talking? Tiffany Fox. Riddler's death may have caused a lot of problems, but I won't make her pay for it. I'll leave that to the man who can't stand killing. I know you think I'm the devil, but I want you to understand. I didn't want... I didn't see things going down like this. Well, I did. I let the mission get out from under me. Never really regained a solid footing. I know how you feel. Well, look at that. You and me on the same page for once. Yeah, that's actually... I just came here to round up the pact. Quick and easy. And if Riddler led you to Sanctus, that would have been a bonus. Listen. Everything I did, I did for the greater good. To protect Gotham, to uphold the law, to make the world a safer place. Whatever your reasons, you went too far. You escalated things on the bridge. You got people killed. And coming after me? What were you thinking? You sided with that maniac. What was I supposed to do? Give you a medal? You act so high and mighty. At the end of the day, you're just a rich guy with all the toys beating up on lunatics. I deal with criminals who threaten my city. You're so far up your own ass, you can't see the truth. You're as nuts as any of them. Avesta had you pegged the minute she walked in your office. She started listing off your pals. All those friends of yours who went cuckoo. How do you think I catch them? I need to be to do what I do. I'd have to agree. We're done here. Signal the withdrawal. Finally. Get the hell out of my city, bitch. I'm not gonna miss her, that's for sure. Yeah, nobody is. So, here we are once again. Gotham safe because of you. Yay. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie. It felt pretty good getting my hands dirty. Good? Just like old times, huh? 
Truth is, after I got ousted, I didn't know my place anymore. Turned into an old guy in civvies, lurking around crime scenes. Trying to stay useful. We have to work together, Jim. Solve cases. Lock up the scum who terrorize our streets. I'd like that. So would I. Oh, uh, I gotta take this. Wife probably saw the news. <laughs> See you around, Batman. Don't be a stranger. I won't be. Don't worry. Tiffany, <gasps> we need to talk. Yeah. Yeah, I figured. You're hurt. It's nothing. I saw you take much worse. Huh. Joker was going to cut Waller ear to ear. I had to create a distraction. It was certainly distracting. My confession. It took you by surprise, didn't it? I just couldn't keep it in anymore. You know I don't condone killing. Not even scum like Riddler. I've been dreading this moment. Especially since I learned who you are under that mask. I was afraid of what might happen if you found out. I guess I was hoping you never would. I wish I hadn't. You put me in a difficult position. I know, I'm sorry. But I wasn't thinking about that at the time. I wasn't thinking about anything except what Riddler did to my family. My mother hasn't left the house since the funeral. And Luke? He just lashes out. My father's death broke them. It broke all of us. I won't ask for forgiveness. But I hope you can understand why I had to do it. I just felt so powerless. Like my life was crumbling around me. Revenge is an impulse, one to be checked. I can't condone it, but I do understand it. Thank you. That means a lot. I couldn't bear it if you despised me. So, where do we go from here? I suppose this puts me on your most wanted list, rather than us working together. If you want to fill your father's shoes, you need to learn right from wrong. You need someone to teach you. you. You're giving me a second chance? Think of it more as a sentence. You'll have to work hard for your redemption. I promise I won't let you down. Then let's get started. What's next? Wayne man.
I was going to write a note, but I'm not a coward. At least I don't want to be. Not anymore. Then again, this won't be the first time I've found my courage in a single malt. Courage for what? Saying goodbye. I'm leaving, Bruce. It's time I went in search of better pastures. You just need rest, Alfred. Why don't you take a long vacation? Some place in the sun, and on the other side of the world from Gotham. I rather think this vacation will be permanent. But why? This war of ours is not what it was when we started. I no longer have the stomach for it. It's not sustainable. At least not for me. Come on, Alfred. You know I can't do what I do, what we do, without your help. Well, maybe you don't have to do it at all. Our mission used to be so clear. Catch the criminals, lock them up. But nothing is clear anymore, at least not to me. Now everything has become so gray. <laughs> gray? Talk to me, Alfred. We used John Doe, exploited his friendship to get you into the pact. We took advantage of someone you met in an asylum, for God's sake. Someone clearly challenged with a proven tendency to violence. Well, it worked, didn't it? In a manner of speaking. You empowered John Doe, kept him close when you should have put him away, inspired him to become something far more dangerous than he ever was. What's your point? Sometimes, it's as if Batman creates the evil he means to destroy. For all our good intentions, I fear we only make things worse. What? No way, come on. A dreadful thought, I know, but one that keeps me awake at night. Oh, please. There were plenty of criminals around before Batman showed up. I put most of them in jail. Two-Face, Cobblepot, Lady Arkham, Joker, all they have in common is you. Anyone who comes into contact with us suffers. Lucius is gone. Tiffany has blood on her hands. I foolishly thought bringing her in might make things better. As if her enthusiasm might remind us how things were in the beginning. We put her in danger on her first day, dodging machine guns at a crime scene. The lives we touch are touched by pain. Friends, colleagues, innocents. No one is spared. That's a price I'm willing to pay. In war, there are always casualties. But it doesn't mean you give up the fight. I've served in my share of wars, Bruce. More even than you. There are some fights you cannot win. One thing is for certain. My tremors are gone. <laughs> well, that's great news, Al. They stopped the minute I made the decision to go. I thought it was the kidnapping with Lady Arkham that caused them. Some kind of residual trauma. But I had it wrong. This sense of powerlessness I've been feeling, it came from something I saw in you. The what? tremors, the fainting spells, all of it. Alfred, I'm... I'm so sorry. I've caused you so much pain. No, no, please don't misunderstand me. Let me explain. Your father was driven by an obsession, by a need to control. He rushed headlong into the darkness, thinking himself invincible, oblivious to the cost. Just like you. Not like me. I chase that darkness away. And yet, history is repeating itself. I'm more certain of that with every passing day. Okay, maybe I am more like my father than I want to admit, but our paths are different. Can't you see? The paths may diverge, but they end in the same place. Face down in an alley, shot in the dark by criminals in some godforsaken corner of Gotham. I won't be witness to that. I won't bury you, too. I stood by and did nothing while Thomas destroyed himself, along with everything he loved. I enabled him, like I'd been enabling you. Realizing this, I've never felt so helpless. I wanted things to be different for you, my boy. You deserved a better life than the one I gave you. 
I've failed you, and for that I'm sorry. We failed each other, Alfred. My obsession, my relentless effort to stop crime. I should have seen the harm it was causing you. A father takes care of his son, Bruce. Guides him through the world. Not the other way around. Well, I don't want to miss my flight. There's always traffic around the airport. You don't have to do it, Bruce. There are other ways of doing good in the world. But you, you pour everything into your bloody crusade. And I know you too well to hope you'll ever change. What? Give up Batman or give up Alfred? What? Alfred, wait. Would you stay if I promised things would be different? Is that a promise you can keep? Like you said, there are a lot of ways to help. I'm sure the city could use a man of my talent and resources. Are you sure about this? I'll do whatever it takes to keep our family together, Al. Even this. What? So please, tell me you'll stay. Well, maybe just one more night. I guess I just gave up Batman for Alfred. Well, and that's it. Evaluate choices. You got that look in your eye, the kind that says you're trouble. Bolt. I'm the whole goddamn hurricane. Okay. Gotham safety is slipping out from under me, and I can't stand it. I weighed my options, and what can I say? I don't like to lose. I won't let you down. Right, thanks. The criminally insane. You're drawn to them, aren't you? If a man hides in plain sight for that long, does he forget who he really is? We're two threads in the same stitch, bound together, even under strain.
Visitor for John Doe. Bruce! <laughs> what? I don't get it. Alright ladies and gentlemen, so this is gonna be it for Batman Telltale series The Enemy Within. I hope you all enjoyed it and I'll see you guys in the next um, Telltale game and until then, bye bye. Alright guys, and thank you for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. I really appreciate all the support you've given us. Uh, please comment, like and subscribe for more awesome content. And please also check out all of these thumbnails around me for more fantastic content from projects. Alright? Alright, and until the next time, bye bye.